Hello, everybody, and welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation, and this is Guncho, a Wild West turn-based tactics roguelike that I'm excited to be checking out here today. I played a free kind of beta version of this game like a year ago over on itch.io, and I really liked it, and I'm excited to see that they're going to be making it into a full thing. We're going to be checking out the demo here today on Steam. So in, we're going to go to see what it's all about. Howdy, partner. Welcome to Guncho. Let's learn how to play the game. Click and drag the screen to move the camera around, yes sir. Right mouse to rotate, yes sir. You can move one tile per turn. A highlight on each adjacent tile shows you where you can move. Click on a highlighted tile to preview the move. Click it again to confirm. Boop. I'm doing it. We're gaming. On the bottom of the screen, you can see the revolver cylinder and its bullets. Your standard bullets have a range of three tiles. Okay. You shoot a target within range, and you can unload a bullet to wait for a turn. Here's three crates for target practice. Destroy him now. Alright, so... We are going to be shooting in the direction of... Okay. Of the kind of, like, bullets down here. So here's the thing. If we fire... Doesn't it? Yeah. Does a little rotate. One sec. Alright, so we have that here. I guess we could just... We can change the rotate direction of it. Gotcha. So that's something that would have been beneficial for us. Can we shoot over this? We can. Okay. Alright. Good deal. For a full reload, you have to unload all the remaining bullets. Try it out now. Just tell me to waste them all one by one there. Yes, indeed. After moving, shooting, or unloading a bullet, Guncho's revolver cylinder will rotate by one step. You can toggle the rotation direction in the middle. Yep, did learn that one. It's all right. In the middle we go. In Guncho, you fight your way through a series of levels. Each level has a number of attack waves that will spawn multiple enemies that you have to defeat. The yellow markers above the tiles show where new enemies will appear on the next turn. Hello. There are multiple types of enemies with different movements and attack patterns. When you click on enemies, you can access an enemy manual to learn more about them. Hello. Okay, range of one, moves one tile per turn, can attack non-blocked adjacent tiles. Trapper throws a trap, okay, that he will kick and push towards the player. He can also push units on adjacent tiles. Tiles in reach of enemies are color-coded to show you where you can safely move. Darkened tiles indicate that an enemy can interact with it. Red indicates that an enemy will attack Guncho standing on it. Defeat all the enemies. So here's my question. You look like you're targeting this tile right here, and you seem to be the one that's hitting me. So can I just kill you in one hit? Sure can. So we're rotating this way, which means... Okay, so you are going to hit me. So, okay. Interesting. Gotcha. I, okay, I understand how the, uh, the old push works now for me. Do I want to move over? If I move over, so... We should be safe here. Go ahead and go for a blast. All right. Well, golly, I've done it. Very good. These are the basics of gun show. You can restart the tutorial from the settings menu. I shan't. Let's go for the normal run. Thank you for trying the gun show demo. This demo version has a turn limit of 75 turns, but you can restart the game as often as you'd like. Oh, interesting. There's a special demo achievement for reaching up the boss level if you are up for a challenge. Oh, okay, so there's like a can-you-get-to-the-boss-within-75-turns kind of vibe. Interesting. So we're rotating this way, so this should not be a problem as long as we go for you first. And if I kill you before you push it, you're not going to push it, right? Yes. Yes, sir. Oh, let's go. Select a new ammunition upgrade or an ability. Ooh, I'm really curious. Uh, give me an ability first. 
Swap position with an adjacent unit. Additional options are locked in the demo. Gotcha. Okay. All right. Sure. Did it look like we got uh, three options for each? Or th that we could only have three of each? So we could stand here. Adjacent units within two... Wait. Within two tiles away will be pushed back from the explosion. Presumably they'll take damage too, right? One would only assume. I kind of want to stay still, but I don't know if I want to drop a bullet for it. So I guess I will move down here. Oh, I did not see that man. Well, boy, howdy. If I move, are you guys going <laughs> to... Is that the right, right way to go? Oh, they're not going to shoot at each other? This is rough. So the good news is, if I move right here, they shouldn't be able to keep on going. The fact that I'm flanked like that is, is pain. Okay. The wall will help me, though. Oh, boy, howdy. Welcome to the Wild West. Alright, let's check out an ammunition just so we know what they're both like. After a full reload, increase the amount of bullets that explode on the first impact by one. <laughs> After a full reload, increase the amount of bullets that will explode on impact by one. That sure looks like it's going to be this one. Oh, boy. Are we going to want it to rotate this way? I mean... I guess we'll go down here. We're safe from the wall. God dang it, it's you again. It's another man. That being said, we are safe. As long as we don't run into somebody who... Uh, uh-oh. Takes two bullets. I don't know that I'm going to want to go for an explosive shot here. This feels... That feels wrong. Uh, does this take a turn? If this takes my turn, this is a problem. It does. I'm so glad I didn't do it. Okay. Blast up there. Are you... Is that going to push me? Or not? If it pushes me into the barrel, we do not like that, obviously. I think that he's just going to throw another stick of dynamite like this. Which is not that big of a deal. No, okay, he was doing, indeed, a whole different thing. So I don't have, uh, I do not have the bullet for this. But if we rotate it this way when we move up... We could pop him with the bullet, but it's not going to do anything because he's too far. Uh... I think we're fine. Good morning. That was a lot more turns than I would have liked. That was a lot more turns than I would have liked. But it kind of makes sense. If you start to run out of uh, bullets a little bit, increase the range of your bullets by one. There is, in fact, one turn in which that would have been relevant so far. May continue to be relevant, though, so who knows. All right. <laughs> All right. Do I do it? Do I go ham? I think we go ham. Well, geez, man. Theoretically, I can just move right here, though, right? 
There's a lot happening. Oh, man. What is even happening? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Pop another. Next. Didn't see that man down there. He's going to be throwing that stick of dynamite, which is unfortunate for me. Part of me wants to just scooch on up, like, rotates places with the barrel. But I don't know if that's going to go well. Surely this does damage, right? It will explode when attacked and deal lethal damage to adjacent tiles. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. That's the thing, is I'm in my head I'm like, I'm looking for does one damage, but there is no one damage. It's you're dead, dude, or no, you're not dead, dude. These do lethal. Moves one top per turn, can throw dynamite over obstacles. Takes two turns to explode. Yeah, I'm not in a not in a great spot here. I do think that if they throw the dynamite oh, if they throw the dynamite on me, do I does it explode immediately? In that case, like, if it does hit me, then it will explode. Unsure. If I move here, then the next turn is going to... I can trade places with the dynamite. Interesting. Um... This is a, this is a relatively safe spot. Next. We are going to have to deal with this... Oh, boy. This garbage. Uh, I think I do want it to rotate this way. Actually. Oh, we should have rotated the other way then. Oh, God! <laughs> this is so bad. Um, is this safe? Yeah, <laughs> for me. <laughs> Pop. So do I not full reload? I do indeed full reload. We shuffle it on up. We do have an explodey boy as well. And by that, I mean an explodey bullet. What is that? Is that, is that an axe? That's the axe. Okay. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Good morning. <laughs> God, it's so, it's so good because it's just so... It's so elegant, man. Leap on a tile two tiles away. We only have the one option for those. Leap on a tile two tiles away. I don't know that I'm going to really want to go for a leap. Depending on what you are, this could be a good place to go. One, two, three, four. Okay. We need to do some learning. Uh, We'll charge at the player pushing him away and any unit in his way if he can't directly charge. Search for a better position. Moves one tile. On explosion, any adjacent unit is pushed back a tile. It said it doesn't say it does lethal. Oh god. Oh, so this makes you shuffle shuffle a couple. I'm trusting. Okay, cool. Oh god, dude, wait. Moves two tiles. If he's adjacent to the player, he will activate his dynamite, which will explode with a one-turn delay. 
That sure seems like he's gonna blow up, like, for real, for real. Just in case. Do you instant blow up? Yep. Good morning. Uh-oh. We might need to do a little bit of a, a little bit of a hip, a little hop. We got Axeman coming our way as well. If I rotate it this way... Oh, okay. There's just too much down here. As far as jumps go... If I jump up there, I can theoretically blast you. And it should be the only thing in... Oh! Oh, it didn't rotate. Gotcha. Well, I don't want to jump over then. Because I have the explosion. Oh, that's not good. So you're not even going to run, though, is the issue. God, this exploding bullet is, is not helpful. Because, see, that doesn't rotate, which is not good right now. This could be good, though. I'm with it. Apparently, if I just step up here, we're still safe. You know what I'm going to do, though? I'm going to hop, and maybe some men are going to do a little bit of... Yes, sir. A little bit of yes, sir. Good morning. Got the trap there. Um... Rotating this way? You're... I don't know. You're probably moving... If you're moving here, I like this. Oh, you did not move there. I do not like it. Okay, we got a couple weird things. I think we... Are a little bit more scared of you. Theoretically, if I just shuffle, do you get hit by this trap? Okay. The answer is yes, but. Oh, God, I could shuffle you again. This is getting too... This is getting really tight. Get owned. This ram is... Uh, I want to get rid of this freaking... If I jump over there, what happens? Do I slip and slide past to another spot? If I move down here, it's just... I really want to get rid of this last one. You do damage, right? Not necessarily. It doesn't say that it will do lethal damage. Will charge the player, pushing him away and any unit in his way. If you can't directly charge, just search for it. There's a chance that it doesn't kill. But I don't really want to... Just, like, hope. But we don't have, like, a good hop spot. I think we'll go here. Yeah. Not a lot of good safety. Whoa! Okay, I'm... So, okay, we learned. That man, he's gonna push me into the fire. He is gonna push me into the fire. I can't... I wanna do... the fire. This freaking ram is driving me crazy, man. Driving me absolutely crazy. I don't know what to do. I have to keep on hopping around. Oh, there. That's sad. I feel... Okay. I feel... Okay. I feel a little bad about that. Uh, 
I I'm down for being pushed. So we can finally Wait, what? You're kicking that How are you kicking the trap from there? How are you kicking it from there? What is wrong with you, dude? I'm so not going to have the turn limit. All right. Idiot. <laughs> Please don't have this right one be the Okay, thank you. What are you kicking? He's I'm just, he... I'm not sure if that's a bug or I'm just not understanding the laws of physics a little bit here. But we finally found uh, a brief little bit of safety. And we're good. I just needed to reload. We are not making it in this turn timer limit. That that round is pain, man. Give me another ammunition check. Increase the amount of adjacent tiles that get burned after hitting a target by one. Is that good for us? Really? <clears throat> I'm not sure. There's a wild play we could go here just by doing like a little bit of a... A little bit of a jump up. Let's do it. Good morning. Who's it going to be? All right. I now that I understand the ram a little bit more, we'll see how this goes. Okay, so it kind of like pushes us in a random spot, huh? Thank you, ram. Oh boy! No, oh! <laughs> poor guy. So the TNT does take a turn or so. We should we should be chilling. What is this, though? Unlimited range? Unlimited range? Uh... Is stunned and pulled towards... Let's, you know what? Let's live a little. What is this going to mean? Okay. Could have been a disaster. The question is, do I want to pop you? Oh, the, the real question is, do you explode on death no matter what? He looks like somebody who would, and therefore I'm scared to just assume he won't. Okay. This is you, right? <laughs> Whose team are you on? Whose team are you on? Yeah. Oh, thank God for the jump, but... <laughs> oh, boy. I need to get a reload. I'm not confident that this is going to save us, though. Oh, you killed a cactus. So you can't, uh, you can't go for the reload? How dare you! I gotta be honest. No, don't do this. Don't do this style of, of demo limit. Oh, man. That's so frustrating. <laughs> just let me... Just do a limited amount of content, and you can go to do that. Because I want to do... I was just, what, a, what a jerk. Oh... I do want to, I want to dabble around a little bit. I really like it. I really do like it. Oh, man. 
I'm disappointed because of how, uh... Are you actually... So you're gonna actually kick that. You can die so fast in this game. Hmm. Uh, which way do we go? It shouldn't matter. But yeah, that there was the one map that we basically had to stall a whole bunch. And I just was like... In the back of my head, I was just going... That, yep, I remember there's a demo, there's a demo turn timer limit, and that's going to screw me. Instantly shoot all bullets with a target. After hitting the first target, the remaining bullets are chosen in random order. That seems really good. I mean, but so is the jump, I guess. My first thought is like, are the abilities just like a lot better then I mean cause here's the thing I can go oh okay it's it's like a random amount of bullets is that the uh the whole thing all right I don't know which way he's going. Oh, I got lucky. Oh, I got lucky there. Didn't know which way he was going. I think we need to stall in place more. The swap was really handy. The jump is really good. Like, it's really good. What happens if I step on the oil... And the, okay, nothing. Hmm. It's like a decently safe spot, though. Come here, buddy. Yow, buddy. Interesting choice, my guy. Oh. Okay. Gotcha. So that's how that works. If that pushes you into an object, then you get the stun. That mutually assured destruction. Oh, you can restart twice on that level. Interesting. Well, that's really... Oh, that's really interesting. I'll try this out, but I don't know if it's going to really be... Oh, it is. It's 100% better. Good morning. Now this is a problem. That's a problem. No jump, no uh no way out. God, it's 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 amazing how uh how much this sucks. So what's your deal? It's like when he sees a target, he takes aim in one turn, laser attacks towards his dark, ignoring his his aquatal target. I'm not safe here, am I? No, because the annoying thing is I'm not safe here because of the barrel. The only thing I can think of instantly shoot all bullets with a target. I see, I see, I see. I see. I get how this works now. Unfortunately, I don't have this guy as a target up here. So all this would be would be a mutually assured destruction meme dream. But yeah, this it's it's there. It, it, there's nothing. There's nothing. There's no way out. Cause I shoot you, then he kills me, I shoot you, he kills me. I press this, we go boom. Boom, and then we explode ourselves for fun. Which does do lethal, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We shift with this, then we die to the barrel. We shift with... That's the only thing we can shift with. We move... Here we die to the... Uh, this is just a no-win situation. We just got... Uh, we countered at champ select there. Well, I'm gonna go out my way, baby. 
And then we'll try one more. Man, this just makes me even more bummed that we didn't get to do... Didn't get to finish up the actual uh, run we were working on. So, what is the... What is the situation, then? We can't go up here. I mean, I guess we go down this way, but I don't really like it. I could just, like... Giga Chad walk into his face. Alright. So why is this blowing up? It's it's because of you? Let's find out. I'm willing to go absolutely wild with it. I I don't know. This might push the barrels. I don't know if that's going to explode the barrels or not with the push. The answer is no, it does not. Alright. Stay there, buddy. That's fine. So I get pushed and theoretically what? Stunned? No, you don't get stunned if you're pushed into the wall. Understood. I can't swap places with a cactus. That's going to push me into the fire if I go that way. Yeah, see, this is the unfortunate thing about the time limit. Is uh, I feel like I want to make plays that are bad. Because, um, like, an aggressive and quack, like, quick. So we can hit that time limit. Quack. Let's check an, an ammunition ability. Ay, ay, ay. It could, it can be good. It did help us sometimes, but I do think that on average these abilities are feeling a little bit more impactful. I really want to try it this sucker out, but I don't have a good spot. If we go down there, we're getting going real aggro with it. Let's go up here and hope beyond hope that you are <laughs> okay. If I move here, what's the deal? You're pushing the barrel. I feel like if I shoot you. I feel like if I shoot you, you explode, right? Oh, I'm dead. Ooh, we're not. <laughs> oh, shoot. See, this would be really good if there wasn't a barrel right by me. Can I swap places with him? Swap place with the barrel and, and die. Uh, well, he can attack non-block tiles when he sees a target. Ignoring... So, here's my question. I wonder, like, I don't know if, if swapping places with you saves me or not. Like, because both tiles are red and threatened. So, I will... Okay, all right. <laughs> Don't... I, see, this is the problem. This, this again, as good as it is, and it seems quite good. Oh, the ram, too? If I rotate... I don't know the order of operations on the ram. Okay. I don't have the bullet in the chamber for this guy. It feels all right. They might, they might move in a spot that's... Oh, finally. This should get both of them. Oh, finally, finally, finally. Ah, you're just like not gonna... Okay. You, you, I'm so confused why he's not doing his shot, but it might actually save him here. Oh, this is not good. I am without many a good bullet. Oh, it, it really depends on what this is going to be. Oh, shoot. Because we can't swap places with this guy. 
Okay, that ended up being fine. Good morning. That poor ram. Okay. Should be good. Move closer. Not bad. Not bad. All right. Ability or ammunition. I'm curious. Kick. Push away a unit five tiles. So these are probably... Those are probably the symbols for other bullet or other abilities. I'm really curious. Hmm. Yeah, sure. Whoa! Would it, wait, would I have fired again? Oh, you know what? I don't know about that. Where are you going? You are going for the mutually assured destruction, you absolute giga chad. This is concerning. I don't know what will happen here, but let's just... Aww. They're just nice guys. I feel like it's not going to work if I push you in, right? It's not actually going to work. Oh, we're dead. Somehow we're not. If I had a full chamber there, oh, hello. Would have been a beaut. You're not going to start as well, are you? No. Okay, good. We actually got the bullet in a good direction there. Asterisk. Oh, that guy's a polite man. Oh my god, wait. It's beautiful. You get the explosive shot out of the chamber, then guess what? All of a sudden, that sucker's not bad. Um... I could just, like... Try and chill a little on that. Holy, dude. Okay. He is crazy. He's a dead eye. Can I kick this? I could. That's fun. I'm not gonna. <laughs> oh, God. Bang, bang. Does leave us with a weird spot here. Just don't want to walk on the trap. Oh. Oh, you're gonna kick me, huh? <laughs> we'll stop. Oh, this is this is just a time limit waster this level. I hate you. I don't know how to I don't know how to approach him. I think we have to approach him this way. Which is very bold. It's the explosive.
There we go. Make him approach me. You deserve this. You deserve that so much, my friend, my friend. 62 turns. It ain't happening. We're getting demoed again. Gun show style. So we have to get the ammunition. So yeah, you can have a limit of three. Increase the distance. Adjacent units get knocked knocked back after hitting a target by one. What? After hitting a target. Okay. All right, we got. <laughs> got no turns at all to, to handle this sucker. Got a little bit of dynamite. You want to move on down, my friend? No. I mean, we have to go aggressive. I think in order for us to have this, we need to see if... Well, but the thing is, then we're going to blow up the dynamite. It's, it's not happening. It is just not happening. All right. Good morning. Good morning. Let's find out. So, he does not explode, at the very least, unless, um... Okay. Do a little bit of that. See what's up. Good morning, maybe? Ooh, I think we, we gotta pop you. Not looking good regardless on that. Wait, what? If he throws... Okay. Alright, well, I'm dead. I'm, I'm dead anyways. If he throws dynamite into a fire... Dynamite takes two turns to explode. Alright, well, then I, I was just toast from get-go then on this one. Because I don't have the bullets. A shame, a shame. It just happened to be the tile on fire for the rest of the turn. Oh, that's a feels bad, man. We do get some retries, but it's not going to matter. I could, like, go down there and hope that, um... Okay, right here we've got, like, a little bit of a one-two punch. <sighs> ah! Yes. Okay. Screwed over a little. Ah! <laughs> I, come on! I, come on, man! You've got to be kidding me! They keep throwing it into the fire! Wait! Why did it say it was going to blow up? I'm glad it's wrong. I'm very happy it's wrong. Eat it. Oh. Okay. So, okay. Knocked back from hitting a target. Knocked back from hitting a target. Seems like it might apply to me. Because why... That, that has an explosion radius of one. Or no. So this... No, this has a pushback. Okay, it probably has the same pushback radius as this. So anything in here gets hit. Anything in here gets pushed back. That is not helpful. I'm doing it again, and I don't care. Okay, I do care. I'm not going to... I'm not going to be that stupid with it. I do think that a, uh, a swap to get on your side over here is probably in the best opportunity for me. See, yeah, I don't know. The pushback seems like it's... If this pushes me back, I would have been livid. Don't really want to shoot the goat. But... I have to shoot the goat. Ah! 
All right. We can do a little bit of a, a little bit of a rotatey do. To do an itty bitty murder. Uh oh. <sighs> There's a not a lot of places to hide. And I'm out of turns. <laughs> Dang, nabbit. That first run, I feel like we maybe had a shot, you know? Uh, the jump especially seemed really, really good. But, hey, game's very good. I I would, I would uh, you know, suggest against this being the style of uh, the demo. And maybe that's just me. But I'm sure there's reasons for it. It's because you don't want to have people burn out on it. But I think you can do the same thing by just, like, limiting the amount of stuff in the game like they already did anyways. But, oh, hey, maybe that's just me. Because I really would have loved to see the, the boss that was there. And I know we could do it just by getting good and doing it in a shorter amount of turns. But there are some situations where the right way to play is to take more turns, you know. Uh, game's fantastic, though. It's one of those games that's... One of those turn-based tactics games that's just really tight and elegant. It does seem like there's going to be situations in which there is no out. And that is rough. But it does have the nice baked in, like... So, we had two re two retries, and then we had three retries. So, my guess... I think an interesting way to do it would be, like, you start with two retries, and then, like, every level you complete, you get one more added to your bank or something like that. I don't know if that's how it works. Because we didn't have to use any retries on our first run because we were cooking. The one that got kneecapped. Um, but... Yeah, either way, really, really cool game. I like it a lot. I can't wait to see what the full thing is like. Uh, it's one of those games where, like, I know people will be like, well, how replayable is it going to be? Well, it's going to be replayable in the sense that it's just very good. Like, this is the game kind of game that you would want to come back to and pick up just for a few runs. Because you can do it in a good speed. Like, you can do it in a relatively short time frame. We did two almost full-ish, I don't know how full... It's going to be in the end. Full-ish types of runs. It's very tight, very fun, very clean. I just really liked it. It's it's minimalist. I loved it. Gun show. Go check it out. Link at the top of the description if you want to check it out for yourself. Go beat the demo in that time limit. That will give, it, uh, give you guys something to do at the very least. But hey, I'm sure I'll check this out again when it's out because I really like it. Thank you for watching, though. Check out the channel for roguelikes and more every single day. If it's a genre you're into, this is a channel you should be subscribed to. Thank you, thank you, and I will see you next time. Bye.